What's up? Hi guys. <laughs> Listen, as you can see, we're actually in Aaron's car right now. There's my kid. Yep. Hey. Hey Everett. Um, <laughs> we were driving and I just kind of talking about all the exciting things God is doing at our campus and the changes and we just had a brilliant idea and it involves every single one of you. Um, frankly, one of the things that we have been working really hard to do is to lead people to that serve, to leave people out of the morning experiences to the evenings. And really, um, everybody, many people on our team have been receptive and have moved, which is awesome. And we're going to continue doing that um, because we want to make room at the morning experiences. But where that puts us is we have lots of opportunities in the morning. And, and our vision, uh, part of the reason for the change is that um, as we move people out, we want to get new families connected. So those families that are already coming to the 10, 1130, who will now be coming in the 930, 11, we want to get them connected. We want to see them growing in their faith. We want to see God use their gifts and talents for the kingdom and for um, everything that he's doing at our campus. So this is where you guys come into play. Aaron, tell us more about it. Okay, so this weekend, because it's a huge invite weekend with Michael Jr. being up um, and it's gonna be so much fun, it's a great weekend to, in fact, connect with a lot of those new families or people who have consistently been coming in the morning but maybe have not yet chosen to move to an evening experience. And so as we brainstormed about who are our most charismatic with just such woo and excitement and vision for what God's doing people, we thought about you guys and that's why you're on this group text with right. this video that is gonna <laughs> apparently be too long for us to actually text you we don't hurry. <laughs> but the point is we thought of you guys and so what we're asking is that for this coming weekend, if you could commit to being at at least one, if not all three mm -hmm. of the morning experiences, 8, 30, 10, 11, 30, with a specific covert task of mm -hmm. talking to families and, and seeing about how they can get plugged in and serving. And it doesn't have to be ministry specific, just plugged in serving somewhere on the weekend. And here's the thing, we're not talking about it from stage. It doesn't go along with what's going to happen from stage. Mm -hmm. Zach is um, doing stage this weekend about local missions, but it'll give you guys a great opportunity, either families you don't recognize, so they're new, or families that you recognize that are always there but are not yet plugged in, to approach them with all of your awesome personalities mm -hmm. and just say, look, are you involved yet? Because this is one of the best ways that I can think mm -hmm. and what I've experienced to get plugged into what God's doing is through serving. And so you can give them a little bit of your personal story and invite them to join you in serving. And here's the next step that you can give them. Yes, you can uh, invite them to serve. And I just wanna to mention too, um, we can use language. Can we even send this video? It is so long. Yes, we can. It's fine. They're fine. They're very attentive. <laughs> we can um, just help that help people to see, listen, this is an exciting time. We are gearing up for the new building. So now's the time where we want to get people connected, especially because look at the word of God says the harvest is plenty, but the laborers are few. And so we don't want to come at it like, oh, we have all these needs, but this is a great opportunity as we gear up for what's next. So this is what you guys need to do. First of all, um, you're going to let us know which experiences you can do. And then on the weekend, you're going to do two different things. One, as you have these conversations and <laughs> stop and uh, people express interest, you're going to get their name and a way to contact them. And then you're going to give them one of the online application cards or an actual application so that they can go ahead and take a next step. But we, our teams will get a hold of them in the beginning of the week. So you're just going to uh, seal the deal. You're going to get their name, contact information, and then share that with us uh, throughout the morning. We're just asking for this weekend only. And yeah. we really appreciate you in advance, not just for this, but for everything you continue to do and just who you guys are as a part of our core group of our campus and, and with everything God's doing. We're going to wrap it up now. Yep. So let us know. We'll talk to you later. <laughs>